All right, man, let's talk about Tyson Fury, man. He's making the news. He said that Andy DeRees, Andy Ruiz Jr. demanded $20 million. He insisted on that. Uh, he's insisting on um, that nobody wants to fight him, that Joe Joyce blocked the Zang fight. Um, also, Usyk is ducking. I mean, he's saying a lot of different things. Um you know, about what's going on, but a lot of people just don't tend to believe him. All right. Now, I think people kind of believe him on the Al Heyman, Andrew Weiss thing. I mean, it is what it is on that point. Uh, we know how they get down. I mean, I, I mean, I don't know how they appraise fights and, you know, how they go on their worth. I mean, Al Heyman could even pay him $20 million to fight Deontay Wilder. I mean, I don't know why they think they're going to generate that type of money. In the UK, like they over over in the Middle East, I guess they really didn't want to fight. If that's true, which you just never know where you stand at with uh with Tyson Fury sometimes. Um, but he says Tyson Fury, I tried to fight everyone. Andy Ruiz wanted twenty million dollars. So it says uh shot the boxing, the boxing staff. It says the former WBC champion Tyson Fury um, has returned to social media to verbally blast his division rivals. Fury made a voluntary defense of his world title back in December with the one-sided stoppage of Derek Jazor. He was involved in serious negotiations to have an undisputed fight with WBO, IBF, IBO, WBA champion Alexander Usyk in the month of April. Their discussion fell apart when both sides failed to reach an agreement on financial terms for the rematch. Fury was slated to have a fight this summer, but there have been issues with finalizing the opponent. According to form, uh, former unified champion, uh, according to Fury, former unified champion, Andy Ruiz demanded a sum of $20 million for a fight after Ruiz's request. Fury's handlers turned their attention to Zhang, but the Chinese headway is now tied to a contract rematch with Joe Joyce. He said, quote, I've been off Instagram for a while. I've been on holiday. I've been chilling. I've been eating. I've been doing all sorts of ish. But I just want to say to everybody, I want to knock all these mother effers out. I'm ready to rumble. I've not fought since December, though. No fault of my own. I've tried to fight some little midget Usyk, and he's not wanting anything. I've tried to fight AJ. He don't want no smoke. I tried to fight everyone. Andy Ruiz Jr., he asked for $20 million. Silly little B. Don't know where he's got that from. Who's out there? Who's available? Zang, he's a good little fight, but Joyce wants his rematch, so that's not happening now. I'm looking to fight anybody, any place, anytime, anywhere. I cannot wait to fight Usyk, AJ, whoever's out there. I'm going to F you up because I'm the baddest mother effer on the planet. So, I mean, he's not showing that energy towards Alexander Usyk in a while. That's why people not tend to believe him about the Usyk thing. I mean, hey, if they can't make an all-white fight in boxing and they pricing themselves out, they can't come to financial terms, I just think the sport is doomed, honestly. I mean, that's not even a sport that a lot of casuals are are, are, are are clamoring for. A lot of hardcore fans kind of want to see it, but I still think AJ and Wilder is the more popular fight. And that comes to, uh, you know, that comes with all the slander that Wilder get. Uh, you know, they come with all the slander, you know, that he gets. But, uh, but... Yeah, I think that's the fight people want to see more than anything. You know? So, but, um, but, I mean, nobody want to, you know, nobody know kind of where he, uh, you know, where he mentally standing. Maybe Usyk is pricing himself out. Maybe Usyk is dunking. I don't know. He's now telling uh, Bob Arum and, and Bob Arum, I want I want you to give me back. He I want you to give me that fight I'm um, due or give me my contract back. So now he blasting Bob here on on, uh, on Instagram. Um, excuse me. No, uh, but now he blasting Bob here on Instagram. Fury said, "Oh, I know what I want. Top rank, Bob. I want you to give me that fight I'm due." I don't know if Tyson Fury has an idea of what he wants uh, to do or give me. And then at the bottom, that's what Bob's saying in the middle. 
or give me my contract back. So, I mean, this dude is erratic, bro. You don't know where he stand. You don't know mentally where he at. I mean, this dude is up and up and up and down like a merry-go-round. That's just what it is. So, I, I don't, I don't know. And I kind of side with Bob on this one, like, bro, like I don't know what this, what this clown want. You know what I'm saying? I don't know what this clown want. This dude said tripping up in here. And don't know, a lot of people just don't believe him no more. He pulled out of fights. He didn't duck, duck rematches, all types of shit. You know, seemed like he didn't want to fight Usyk. I mean, Dan Bob said, well, they want to wait to December. Now he's saying he want to fight before December. Yo, just don't know. One minute he want to retire. You know, so a lot of people have started to side with Usi. Now he can come on social media and say, oh, smash his little ass and all this type of shit. Okay. Cool. Cool. But get in the ring and do it. You know, what you ask for a larger split for? I mean, you really ain't no pool. Let's be real. You really ain't no pull. And that's just what it is. You know. You know, and that's just what it is. But, uh. But. But we 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 have to just wait and see what they can cook up. I'm trying to get out of here, honestly. <laughs> you know, I mean, Usyk, a promoter, uh, replies to Tyson Fury. He says, "Sweetheart, you lost your chance, your fans, your dignity. Uh, now everyone knows who the real Dawson is. Enjoy your karma, green, greedy belly, and don't forget to pay off the debts." <laughs> Your promoter will remind you. So, Fury said, you know, this is a B. Talking about uh, Usu promoter, both of you and the Rabbit RVs. Come get your 30% as, uh, from today. The fight only happens in the UK at Wembley. Take it or leave it. So, now he's saying he don't want to go to the Middle East. It's the UK. Take it or leave it. So, I mean, it's just to the point. Like, this, this dude, Tyson Fury, is unreal, bro. Let's call it, let's call it what it is. This dude is unreal. Um his demands are unreal. Um, um that's it, it just I mean every, every other day something changes with this dude. And most people just on the strength of believing him that he gonna beat Alexander Usi because what he did to Wilder. And they want to kind of say, well, Usyk's small, and they want to go with a narrative and stuff of that nature about Alexander Usyk. Then, if it's so easy, what you need 70% for? Like I said, Usyk ain't the biggest draw in the world, but neither are you. You know? But out of all the top fights that, that people uh, want to see, okay, out of all the top fights that people want to see, if this one didn't happen, I don't think too many people would be pissed off about it. Just being real, I don't think too many people will be pissed off about it. Just being honest. You know, but I told y'all this man struggles with guys. He struggled with guys. That's that's that that's shorter than him for whatever reason. That's the struggle for him. And he just exploded back on social media. He challenging, you know, he just find is challenging the uh John Jones. John Jones said, Hey Tyson, it seems like Joe struck a nerves with my Rogan because he got a Joe Rogan. I admit there's no one touching you in the ring right now, but let's not let that confuse you with what would happen if you step foot in my cage. If you ever want to put some close questions, uh if you ever want to put some of those questions you got going on the rest, give Dana a call. I help you out. That ain't happening. They ain't about to pay Tyson Fury, uh, pay Tyson Fury that type of money. That's that's a waste of my time. 
him going back and forth with Joe Rogan and, and picking man. It's just he just trying to remain relevant. That's it. He just trying to remain relevant. That's all you got to say. That man just trying to remain re relevant. That's it. He just trying to remain relevant. That's it. He just trying to remain relevant. But uh, yeah, that's pretty much all I got, man. Let me know what you girls and guys think. Check out the heavyweight boxing talk playlist. Thumbs up the video. Share the video. Subscribe to the channel. And the subscribe button is the bell icon button. Hit all notifications. Increase your chance. Get notifications. We go live or drop video financially. Uh, want to support the channel? I mean, you can just uh, find me on Cash App, Venmo, PayPal. Thumbs up the video. Share the video. Subscribe to the channel. The subscribe button is the bell icon button. Also, you can do me that uh, favor when you go to the podcast platform, Apple Podcasts, Spotify, Amazon Music, Google Podcasts, whatever one you listen to, you want to listen to, um, give me a rating on there. In addition to that, man, if you got a podcast platform you want me to add, just hit me up on Instagram or DM me on Twitter. Peace.